American Action Fund for Blind Children and Adults Tactile Art Kit. Basic Geometric Shapes. Find the template for the basic shapes and pull out the circle, square, and triangle. Explore and name each of the shapes with your child. Then show your child how to place a sheet of copy paper on the blackboard and select the circle. Place that template over your paper. Take your ink pen and trace inside the circle with a nice firm line. Remove the shape and show your child the shape that you've created. Now, have your child do the same. Talk about the qualities of a circle. If your child's shape is wobbly, and draws a wobbly circle, remind them that they need to push their pen up against the edge of the template so that their line traces the shape exactly. The circle is a closed shape made from an evenly curved line. A square has four sides which are the same length and they meet at the corners in a right angle. The outside of the triangle is three equal sides and they meet with at three equal angles. Once you draw the three shapes Anne uses the triangle and square templates to trace the shapes. Find a spherical object around your home. Any ball will do, or you can make a ball from the model magic. Now we are going to examine how a three-dimensional object can be re represented as a two-dimensional image. Hold the ball up in front of your child at arm's length. This is so they can't easily reach around behind the ball. Keeping your finger towards the back side of the ball, ask your child to outline the ball with their pointer finger. I'm going to hold this ball out here in front of you and I want you to trace the outside of the ball, the outline, okay? Just with your finger. Just trace it with your finger. Now I want you to watch how I'm doing it. See how I'm tracing the outline of this ball with my finger? We're playing clay. Once you're moving their finger around the ball smoothly, ask them what shape they're making. So when you're going around like that, tell me what shape you're making. It's a circle. A circle, right. If this concept isn't clicking for your child, don't worry. Move on to another fun activity and come back to this in a day or two. This is a very complex concept and it may take a while for your child to fit all the pieces together in their mind. If they are able to answer a circle then ask them to select from the raised line drawings which shape they would use to draw a ball. When you were drawing this outline, you were making a circle. Great. So if you were going to draw a picture of a ball, which of these three shapes would you use to make the Oriana picture indicates of the, ball? the circle drawing. This one. The circle. Oh, check it. Good job. <laughs> Once they seem to have a grasp of the concept, Move on to the cube and the pyramid. These concepts and the vocabulary will lay a firm foundation for your child to express their own ideas and to understand many complex lessons. For more information, visit actionfund.org.